If you ask an Israeli if he's been to Thailand, chances are he'll say yes. You just can't get enough of the exotic and tropical place which sometimes becomes home away from home. With hundreds of thousands of Israeli tourists visiting Thailand each year, it's no surprise that they opened up a Thai restaurant right here in the heart of Tel Aviv. Why don't you talk to us about the different styles of Thai cuisine? Uh, it became the uh, first destination, very popular destination for the Israeli people. And uh, as uh, people discover Thailand, uh, they discover the great taste of uh, Thai food. And uh, I think the Thai uh, kitchen and the Thai food uh, uh, speaks uh, very directly to the Israeli people because the flavors uh, are very strong. Um, Would you think there are similarities with Israeli food and Thai food? There is, there is a similarity between the spiciness and the strong ingredients. Uh, I'm sure you've been to Thailand many times. So each time that you go visit, do you get inspired by new dishes? Of course, all the time. Uh, you discover new things. Uh, even in Thailand now, they make a modern Thai kitchen. and. Uh, when I go to Thailand, usually when I go to Thailand, I go to check uh, new chefs for the restaurant and I meet new chefs, new dishes. Um, I noticed that you guys placed a lot of different plants around the restaurant, really giving it that Thai, Thailand vibe. Yeah, we wanted to have, uh, to keep it simple, like in Thailand, not too fancy. It's a street food uh, restaurant uh, we serve street food dishes a lot of green, a lot of banana trees, uh, coconut trees. Ayad and I then enjoyed a nice glass of classic Thai beer called Singa to kick things off. Thai cuisine is based on blending spicy, sweet, sour and salty into every dish. These bold flavors go excellently into a cocktail. Thai, chili, lime or lemongrass are the ingredients that will most likely be included in your Thai cocktail. So I am in the mood for a fruity cocktail. I want to feel like I'm on the sandy beaches of Thailand. That's great. I have just a cocktail for you. I'll make you the special uh, Nam uh, Mai Tai. Uh, it's a classic uh, Thai cocktail. I'm adding a spoon of blueberries, one shot of rum, half a shot of triple sec, half a shot of lime, fresh lime juice, a little bit of passion fruit, and for closing, I'm adding orange juice, That's great, some ice, and now we only need to shake it. Some pineapple, blueberries, and mint are added on top for the finishing touch. Oh, this is a special Mai Tai. Enjoy. Ooh, thanks so much. Very colorful cocktail. Mmm, delicious. Very sweet. Very fruity, just like I wanted. Because Thailand is such a popular tourist destination, Chabad has opened up centers throughout the country to help Israelis feel at home. And behind me, it is written in Thai, feel at home. What's the spice that's used the most here? Well, uh, everything, every curry paste has a basic of uh, lemongrass, kaffir lime leaves, uh, galanga. This, this is the main spices that that's go on and on. But where do you find authentic Thai herbs in Israel? We grow uh, all the spices, the, the, spi the Thai herbs, and the uh, 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 Thai vegetables in a special farm here in Israel, especially for the restaurant. The special uh, kaffir lime leaves, which you cannot make Thai food without kaffir lime. We have the lemongrass and many, many uh, other things. Now it's the winter time in Israel, so uh, it's a bit difficult to grow uh, the vegetables. Uh, so we use the uh, Israeli options. Now uh, Mr. Sumcha is making pachapau, which is uh, beef uh, 
chopped beef with the kapao leaves. Although tam yam was originated in Thailand, it is also enjoyed by its neighboring countries as well. Its distinct hot and sour flavors and generous Thai ingredients make it a very popular dish here in Nam. The next traditional dish is the infamous pamela salad. It's healthy, light, and refreshing. The sounds and smells of fresh and wholesome Thai cuisine sizzling in the kitchen made me hungry, so it's time to eat. This is sticky rice and somtam papaya salad. Thank you. Enjoy. Sticky rice is, comes in a unique package. What? Mm-hmm, interesting. That's fun. Mm. Although it does look like pasta, it's actually papaya, which is very popular in Thailand. It's refreshing, it's a little spicy. Okay, more food. Let's move this over. Mm. That's really good. It's very flavorful. Having visited Nam and tasting the food, it's clear to see why Israelis eat here when